Phoenix is the capital of the southwestern U.S. state of Arizona. Known for its year-round sun and warm temperatures, it anchors a sprawling, metropolitan area known as the Valley of the Sun. It's surrounded by multi-hued mountains on all sides and is happy to live up to its name for eight or nine months out of the year. Before we get into the top 10 things to do in Phoenix, we've included links in the description to various discount codes and links to resources of things to do, so make sure you check those out. At number 10 is the Desert Botanical Garden. The Desert Botanical Garden is home to thousands of species of cacti, trees, and flowers from all around the world. This 140-acre garden allows you to experience the region's natural wonders the way early settlers once did. The Desert Botanical Garden also hosts numerous events, including culinary demonstrations and outdoor concerts. Number 9 is Phoenix Zoo. For over half a century, the Phoenix Zoo has welcomed guests from around the world with experiences that inspire and motivate them to care for the natural world. The zoo is home to over 3,000 animals, with diverse species ranging from Sumerian tigers and Bornean orangutans to Komodo dragons and American alligators. There are also up-close animal experiences like Stingray Bay, Giraffe Encounter, and Monkey Village. You can also enjoy the Safari Cruiser, 4D Theater, Endangered Species Carousel, and 125 acres of natural habitats. At number 8 is Camelback Mountain. Camelback Mountain is located in Echo Canyon Park, approximately halfway between Scottsdale and the Phoenix Mountains Preserve. Trails are open from sunrise to sunset, or around 7 p.m., and entry is free. As one of the highest peaks in Phoenix, Camelback Mountain is among the most scenic hiking spots in the city. Soaring more than 2,700 feet in elevation, Camelback Summit offers spectacular views of Phoenix and Scottsdale. At number 7 is Papago Park. Just minutes from downtown Phoenix, Papago Park offers exceptional hiking and a wide array of recreational facilities. Comprised primarily of sandstone, the range is known for its massive buttes that rise and fall throughout the park. The trails that interlace the area are generally easy treks. The smooth footing and low elevations make it a popular place for running and mountain biking. Additionally, the park boasts an archery range, orienteering course, Papago Ponds Fishing Lagoon, the Hall of Fame Museum, and Papago Park Baseball-slash-Softball Complex. Number 6 is Pueblo Grande Museum and Cultural Park. Pueblo Grande Museum is located on a 1,500-year-old archaeological site once inhabited by the ancestral Sonoran Desert people, archaeologically referred to as the Hoacam culture. Located just minutes from downtown Phoenix, this site features the ruins of an ancient village which approximately 1,000 people once called home. Walk among what's left of houses, storage facilities, play areas, and cemeteries on a short, accessible trail. You can also view artifacts found during the site's excavation at the small on-site museum. At number 5 is Phoenix Art Museum. The Southwest's premier destination for world-class visual arts, the Phoenix Art Museum has provided access to visual arts and educational programs in Arizona for nearly 60 years and is the largest art museum in the southwestern United States. In addition to an annual calendar of exhibitions, Phoenix Art Museum's permanent collection galleries are drawn from more than 19,000 works of American, Asian, European, modern and contemporary art and fashion design. Visitors can also enjoy photography exhibitions through the museum's landmark partnership with the Center for Creative Photography. Number 4 is South Mountain Park. At over 16,000 acres, South Mountain Park and Preserve is one of the largest municipal parks in the country. A maze of well-maintained hiking trails crisscross the park, and in springtime, the terrain is knee-deep with wildflowers. Free maps are available at the entrance and from the South Mountain Environmental Education Center, you can hike, bike, and ride more than 51 miles of trails or follow the road on top of the mountain for spectacular views. At number three is the Japanese Friendship Garden. Japanese Friendship Garden of Phoenix, named Roho En, is an authentic 3.5 acre Japanese stroll garden with tea garden and tea house. This tranquil and beautiful setting features more than 1,500 tons of rock formations, stone footbridges, lanterns, and more than 50 varieties of plants. As you stroll the path, you will enjoy flowing streams, a 12-foot waterfall, and a koi pond with over 300 colorful koi fish. Number 2 is Arizona Science Center. 
Discover the world of science, history, and imagination at Arizona Science Center. With more than 95,000 square feet of learning space spread across the multi-storied facility, visitors can enjoy more than 300 hands-on permanent exhibits. Events and attractions include the Dorrance Planetarium and the Wonder Center, giving audiences and guests the chance to create a memorable experience that will last a lifetime. At number one is Castles and Coasters. Where all the fun of the fair meets some sky-high thrills, this is an amusement park in the heart of Northwest Phoenix. At an astonishing 10 acres, there are roller coasters, water rides, and an enormous arcade for all sorts of heart-pumping fun. Loop the loop on Desert Storm and get your adrenaline going on the interactive experience XD Dark Ride, where you'll fight off some fearsome zombies. Castles and Coasters has thrill-seeking attractions to fit everyone's interest. So that sums up our top 10 things to do in Phoenix. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, and if you're new here, feel free to subscribe. Until next video, have a great day.